Alright, um, we're going to do a little pack opening real quick, and if we get anything good, we're going to be using them in Unlimited, because I just got to play one game of Unlimited before and I get that uh, current trophy case item. I hope they don't give me something I already have. But let's get started with this pack opening. I don't want to take too much time on that. You guys already know about the new cards that came into the game today. If you don't, let's uh, just take a quick look at them. We have a... Uh, Pink Diamond Ray Allen, he has a 96 three-pointer, a 90 drive and dunk, 90 speed, 90 ball handle, all that stuff. He's very athletic. He has a 93 vertical. Uh, Kimball Walker, uh, the only thing glitched I know about this card, he has an 82 interior defense. Other than that, everything seems pretty standard. His driving layup and dunk. Well, his driving layup is high. His driving dunk is pretty low. I think it's like a 25. So there's nothing real special about that card, but he does have a nice three-pointer also. Uh, Jared Allen, Jared, Van Jared Allen, Jared Vanderbilt, Kelly Olenek, and Jordan Clarkson. Let's go ahead and see which ones we can pull. Hopefully, hopefully, of course, we're going after Ray Ray. We need another pink diamond. We only got four. Uh, it'd be nice to have a whole lineup of pink diamonds. Nothing on the first one. We got uh, Season 2 Erie Jason Tatum. It's a card we didn't have. We got a we got a sapphire and a ruby on this one. That's two of them. So uh, we got Jordan Clarkson. I've got to say we got two cards. I mean, one of them has to be from the glitch set. We need some original own originally owned players for challenges. Uh, let's just go ahead and do it. Quick sell that. Quick selling some stuff may end up end up letting us open up an extra pack. Pack number three. It is nothing. We got Rodney Rogers and Isaiah Ryder. We did to get two cards, and we had both of those cards. What's up, Gabe? And we got enough for four more packs. I'm thinking that uh, I'm thinking that uh, uh, Jared Vanderbilt. We did get another uh, glitch card. I'm thinking that um, Kimber Walker. I'm thinking that Kimber Walker is not going to be worth it. I don't think he's going to be that good. He's already undersized for defense and. Like I said, this glitched attributes. It looked like it's only the interior defense. That's a, and I don't see what's so great about that for him for a card that small. So I don't even think that card would be worth it. If we can get Jesus Shuttlesworth though, now that definitely would be worth it. Okay, we got Kelly Olenek. Kelly Olenek. So we got three of the cards so far. Uh, Kelly Olenek. We got Kelly Olenek, we got Jordan Clarkson, and Jared Vanderbilt. We pulled all three of those. We got a shake. Uh, we got a shake. Okay, that's uh, Amethyst. I was getting happy. We already got that James Johnson, but it's cool to pull two cards. And that is Jared Allen. As a Cleveland Cavaliers fan, I'm happy to be getting Jared Allen on the squad. That is four glitch Clark, uh, four originally owned glitch cards. That's also, I mean, considering the fact that I didn't even start with 100K, it's not like we're spending a lot here, and we're taking a chance on pulling something big without really uh, taking a big risk on MT. Less than 100K is not a big risk. Mark Bryant. Also, uh, we're gonna swap that one with the one from Collections. How come I can't send it to the auctions? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I can send it from there. All right. All right. We didn't get a good pull, but we don't got, I mean, we don't have anything we can add to our lineup, but that's the starting five. Um, I do think that Larry Johnson is undersized as a power forward, but early in the year, I think you can get away with that because speed trumps height right now, in my opinion. It's a lot of slow cars out there. So just him getting down court faster than the, most of his opponents i think that's good enough right there 86 speed and what does pippen have whoever has the highest speed is about to be my uh locked into my power four for the foreseeable future 93 yeah we're gonna have to go with uh pippen right there i just want to beat the other power four down court that's another reason why i'm running uh ben wallace because of his speed uh he has an 83 speed as opposed to deandre jordan who i don't think is slow either 78, no, okay, with that, what, 78 is not that far behind, 83, so we're going to leave him in there, and Noah was the slowest, I think, out of the whole bunch, 67, yeah, that's why he's probably going to be the last in the game, but his defense, still amazing, still amazing, let's go ahead and get started 
We'll see. Oh, he's coming with Amethyst Wilt. It's going to be a hard go for you, my guy. We're going to see. I meant to change all this out of the main menu, so I don't got to keep doing this. Oh, you missed that? What is Kenya Martin's speed, I wonder? There is no way. Oh, that's Zach Levine. That's Zach Levine. They're going to let him get that off. Oh, good block, Will. I knew, man. Will makes up for it being slow as hell. Sometimes, if your opponent is doing something that you know you can be, you know you can defend, you know you can stop it, sometimes it's cool to let them get comfortable with it. I'm not lying. Just let them have it. Especially if they think they can win the game with that. Let them go ahead and do it. It's like you lure them into a false sense of security. They think they're safe with that game plan. You let them go ahead with it. And then you shut that shit off when you're ready. Ooh, that's short. That's short. Yes, sir. Again, sorry, DeAndre there. DeAndre there, scooping up all that. Yeah, I seen takeoff pass that is side. I wanted to do a video on it, but I was like, uh, I did, man. It was, I was like, I just left it alone. Like it was really, that really hurt. You know what I mean? Like I didn't want to do a video on it. I just left it alone. I gotta say, it was him and Offset. It was like, you know what I mean? I Quavo would have been my third one. I liked Offset and Takeoff before Quavo. And to hear that he got shot over something that didn't even have anything to do with him. He was just a bystander. Oh, Halloween was pretty quiet and basic, basic day. Like, I didn't, we don't do nothing special on Halloween around here. My kids look real cute on Halloween, though. Got some cute pictures of them in their costumes. Why don't this guy quit? Man, we, fuck, we play the whole thing, bro. But I'm saying, like, some people, once they see they can't beat you, why do they keep playing? He missed that easy shot. I cannot believe he missed that easy shot. Why is Will still in the game? This dude got to be tired by now. Y'all dudes got to be tired by now, man. Ain't no way y'all still out there with, with energy. Let me put me some fresh legs on the court. He's still he, he, he going to uh, live and die with the rim running. Let's go then. We're going to rim run in. But there's no way Will got enough energy to get back down court. He don't. But DeAndre can. DeAndre can. Dude, just quit. You're embarrassing yourself. I have a meeting for basketball today. I'm excited because the season starts in the, at the end of the month. Okay. Oh, man. That's, that's exciting for me, too. I love when the basketball season starts in school. That's what I was going to class for in the first place. Like, I was trying to get my grades up so I could be on the team. Like, other than that... I was not. I wasn't really excited about too much stuff in school, other than the basketball season. Hawk, two things I think is overrated. One is streaming on YouTube. Two is NBA 2K23. But 2K period. Just I think 2K is overrated. I think streaming on YouTube is overrated. Dude, we only have four seconds left, and you put me on the line. I thought this, the quarter was about to end, and he gave me some more points. I don't know if I've ever beat anybody by 50 in here before, but let's let's try. Let's just do that. Let's just see if we can beat this dude by 50. He got an and one. A four-point play is the highlight of the game. Probably the biggest highlight for either one of us. Man, once you find out these dudes can just rim run and they can't shoot, you just play a zone. And the CPU will take care of it. Right? Well, you got to move your players around in the zone so some. You do have to move your players in the zone. But for the most part, the zone just fucks up their whole strategy. JR might finally hit. All right, GG, big bum. He's not the biggest, but he is a big one. Get all the numbers out you. Damn, we got 1,600 MT for that game. That's one of my biggest licks on MT ever. For unlimited? Oh, my God. Oh, and we got one, uh, 1250 out the vault. Let's go. Next game, we about to get them 50 tokens. Let's go. We're going to go ahead and edit this and throw it up on YouTube. I'm going to hop off right now because my phone is ringing a lot. Apparently, it's a busy day for me. I'm going to holler at everybody later. Thanks for coming through and chilling, everybody that did. Until next time, it's been me, your boy, EC Rallo, and I'm out. Thank you. Come again.